Welcome to the Siemen Corporation's FiberType video training series. This segment will outline the steps required to properly weld a field-wrapped pipe and perform and verify the integrity of the weld. Siemen Corporation mandates safety first in following all safety precautions as required by federal, state, and local standards, as well as those required by your company. First, measure for your non-reinforced horizontal target piece making sure the target piece extends a minimum of two inches beyond the mechanical fasteners and plates. Measure the pipe's circumference and add one and a half inches for the width of your vertical wrap. The height should be a minimum of 10 inches to ensure you have the eight inch required height. Cut your horizontal target and vertical wrap from non-reinforced membrane to your measurements. Round all corners. Fold your target piece to locate the center. Cut the center hole, ensuring there's a three-quarter inch rise onto the pipe. Install the non-reinforced target over the pipe and into position for heat welding. Clean both the wrap and the field membrane with acetone or MEK and a clean white cotton rag. Heat weld the target piece in place. Check the measurements of your wrap. Preheat the bottom two inches of the wrap to aid in stretching. Stretch the heated area of the wrap. After thoroughly mixing, apply FTR-190E adhesive to both surfaces and allow to tack. Be careful not to get adhesive in the area to be welded. Install the non-reinforced wrap to the pipe. Heat weld all seams. Probe all seams for welding deficiencies and repair as needed. Apply FTR-101 sealant between the top of the wrap and the pipe. Install a stainless steel worm gear clamp to terminate the flashing. Finally, cut off any excess clamp and tool the sealant smooth.